The Salvation Army is a worldwide Christian church and with more than 650 churches and centres in the UK and Ireland, there's one near you. This morning, I'm in Ballymoney to have a word with Tim and Jean Marie Cook. Tim, I remember in years gone by, perhaps at the end of an evening, the Salvation Army might have been in a pub and they did a bit of a collection. Is that an outdated idea of what the Salvation Army is about? Well, you are right. It um, is a bit of an outdated um, version, but um, it still goes on. You know, we still do what they call pub crawls, um, <laughs> but um, we're very much community based and um, dealing with the needs of people mm -hmm. um, on the poverty line and, mm -hmm. um, you know, whatever they need and um, with electric and gas and food parcels. Um, so we're very, we are very much community based nowadays. And you say you're community based, we're here in Balamoni. Mm. How important <laughs> to the people in Balamoni is Salvation Army? Um, speaking to people on the streets when we're selling the war cry in the town, um, it's amazing how many people have a connection with the Salvation mm. Army. Um, the Salvation Army here in Balamoni has been here since 1912. So in a sense we've got 108 years of connections with people. So at some point along the line, you know, everyone at some point has had some kind of connection um, with us. And if we think back over the last number of months, maybe I can address this one to, to Jane Marie. And we've come through, but we're still coming through what we, we perhaps refer to as that COVID period. Yes. Essentially, and especially at the beginning of that, how difficult were, were things for, for the Salvation Army and for people here in this town? Um, I think um, for, for like everybody, um, lockdown really did hit people with a bang, didn't it? And um, for us as a worshipping community, it meant that people couldn't gather um, for worship but also it really highlighted a lot of social isolation, mm -hmm. loneliness, um, which already existed in the town and yes, area. Yeah. It really heightened that. So it um, challenged us mm. to rethink some of how we work um, and how to change that, particularly so, during COVID. And even though we had lockdown and we had quite tight restrictions, yes. you found yourselves busy and in, in demand? We found ourselves busy in a really different way um, because we had to um, think outside the box. So we normally had a befriending project that actually went into people's home and visited them. Um, obviously, we couldn't do that. So a lot of just keeping in contact with people was by telephone. So we spent lots of time on the telephone just yes. checking up that people were OK. Um, sometimes dropping food just outside people's door. Mm -hmm. Um, and different things and sending out um, literature, activity packs to keep people um, with something to do. Um, and I saw something on uh, your Facebook page about, is it new premises or refurbished premises? Um, it's going to be um, refurbished mm -hmm. and renovated and extended, mm -hmm. um, our church hall here. Um, the Salvation Army's had this church hall f um, since the early 60s because mm -hmm. um, it was originally um, where the Church of God um, worship yes yes right. and um, so over the years it's really served the community well um, but like everything in life you know it needs a, an upgrade at some point or other <laughs> yeah and um, yes. so yes the work starts here on Monday the 21st and um, should take about 16 weeks so hopefully by end of January 2021 um, we'll be reopening the best we can obviously depending on what is happening with COVID but um, we should be able to start something um, new for the community then. Uh, finally guys, how can we get in touch with, or maybe even more importantly, how can we get involved with the Salvation Army? Um, we always love um, to hear from people in the mm. community. Um, people can look us up on the website. We've got a Salvation Army website, particularly for Balamoney and mm. Causeway Coast area, mm. and a Facebook page. And also, um, when the renovation starts, we will be having a banner attached to the building with a contact telephone number. So if anybody's interested in more information or would love to volunteer, <laughs> um, please, um, please contact yeah. him and I. We'd love to hear from you. So if you enjoy spending time with people and you have some skills that you'd like to share, then the website address you need to look for is salvationarmy.org.uk. For On the Causeway Coast, I'm Dennis McNeil. Thank <laughs> you.